being retired. Thank you. Super excited about being retired. Why? Because I have my time freedom. Uh, it's amazing how I set a goal uh, several years ago about uh, being time free, uh, have my own time freedom by the age of 55. That was on my wall in my bathroom. I had like seven goals lined up, but I hit four of them. And one of them was have time freedom by the age of 55. Guys, I got laid off at 54 and 11 months. I said, you guys did me a favor. I'm so grateful because all that did was kick me into where God wanted me to be anyway. So I was happy about that. Uh, so this is what's so great about, you know, uh, having those multiple streams of income. I tell people all the time, I tell even young uh, uh, adults coming out of college, going into these corporate positions, do not let this be the end all to your career, to your life, to what you want. Uh, this should be just your plan A, but you, you should always have a plan B and a plan C. Because I had a plan B, guys, for 17 years, I was able to leave that corporate America without even, without even a blip. I mean, literally, uh, May 31st, 2017, into my, my career, June 1, I partnered with my, my sister uh, with her nonprofit, and we've been off and running ever since. And, uh, and it's been nothing but a blessing. But let me tell you what I'm most excited about. What I'm most excited about, all, all the things I've accomplished for the last 58 years. I am 58, yeah. For the last 58 years. <laughs> Yo, yeah, when you get to your 50, you have a question your age, because, you know, the number saw just, like, run together. But anyway, for the last 58 years, what I'm most excited about is what I've, what I've just partnered with right now. I've been a partner with Mr. Bugs uh, with the previous company for 10 years. But this gentleman, uh, because of his, um, I would say because of his integrity, because of his uh, business acumen, because of his ability to, it, to be an uh, innovator, because uh, he's not a creator. He's not a, he's not a person that goes out and, and designs things, and, and, and he's not that. He sees things uh, that are created by other people, and he sees it, and he can innovate it and make it better. And that's what I love about it. So when I got the call from Mr. Edwin Haynes um, before March of 20, uh, March 11th of 2019 about this business, I was like, I'm all in. Please, yes, sign me up right now at the highest position. Uh, and that made me a founding member of this company. And I'm super excited about that because, guys, what I'm going to share with you tonight is, 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 is along the same philosophy of, philosophy of Amazon. If you understand Amazon, if you understand Facebook, if you understand Uber, you will, you will get this. You will get this. And so, you know, you know Amazon's a juggernaut. This is one of those companies that, you know, it's a multi-billion dollar company it's all over the world. It's, you know, one of the number one companies in the world. Uh, and so when Mr. Buck starts explaining this concept, this business model, I'm like, my God, th this is incredible. You know, so I came from the coffee industry with him for 10 years. So I did that with him. He, and people laughed at him uh, when we launched Organo back in 2008 during Hurricane Ike. They said, you guys going to sell coffee? What? Coffee? And they laughed at him. They laughed at this gentleman. They didn't know who they were laughing at. See, they laughed at a gentleman that took that company from zero to $3 billion in less than 10 years. Guys, he, 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 he built a, 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 uh, a sales force of over 3 million people worldwide. This gentleman helped create over 45 million. They were laughing at him in 2008. When they were cooking coffee, heating up coffee on a barbecue pit to get hot water to pour in his little sachet. See, they, they, they were laughing at that young man because they didn't understand his creative thinking. See, he didn't think like the world. He thought outside of the world. See, he doesn't, he doesn't believe that, you know, the world is in him. You know, he doesn't take those things. He, he, what he says, his philosophy is observe the masses and do the opposite. And so when, when he speaks, you best listen because he's going to take you on a journey that could literally change your life forever. So this gentleman who they laughed at in 2008 created a, a revenue for his family, for his legacy of a hundred plus million dollars from one sitting position at one company. I'm talking about a gentleman who said, you know what, but my people are not winning the way I want them to win. See, the industry of direct sales has been the same for the last 60, 70, 80 years. And Mr. Bugs recognized that. He got a little complacent, a little, you know, uh, I think just a little tired of the way things were going. Things were not going the way he wanted them to go with the last company. So you know what he says, you know what, let me do something that I can give back because he's a, he's a big giver. He's one of those people that will go out and drop these big tips on people and they would never know. If he's, he and his wife, Earlene Bugs, that's what they do. So he says, let me create something because 
he was uh, he was disenchanted. He was you know he was not settled in his spirit. And his wife says, "Do what you do best." And so he created this company that he said he would never be a part. He said, well, "I would never be a CEO of a network marketing company. I would never get into the travel industry." And he says because it it just it doesn't pay. But let me tell you something: when when an innovator takes something and looks at it, and he can literally see it for what it is, he's a visionary. And when a visionary gets gets their hands on something, guys, you can't hold them back. You cannot hold them back. So my recommendation is that you hold on because the ride is going to be incredible. What we have right now is a company called iBoomerang. Okay. And let me go ahead and get to the presentation. Mr. Benson, do I have control? Yes, ma'am. I made you the co-host. Okay. So I can't, uh, it says I can't share the screen. One person, it says one participant can share at a time. Uh, multiple participants can share now simultaneously. Should I hit that? Uh, hit that. Is it letting you share? Uh, we'll see. Hang on, guys. Okay, maybe I was in the wrong thing. Okay, perfect. And I apologize. Good. All righty. So let me see here. So what we're talking about is iBoomerang. Let me go full screen. Okay. Can you guys? Okay. Let me stop it. Let's start it again. And this is technology, guys. We are in a technology company. Trust me. Cancel. Share screen again. And... Okay, can you see me? Clear as a bell. Excellent, okay, thank you. Okay, so we're talking about a company by the name of iBoomerang. So if you understand the, 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 uh, the uh, activity of a boomerang, if you understand, if you take a boomerang down in Australia, that's where it comes from, and you throw that boomerang out, and the boomerang should come back to you, okay? It's one of those things that they created, and when you throw it the proper way, it'll come back directly to you. So Mr. Bug says, you know what? I'm going to take the same concept and I'm going to create a business around it. And he calls it iBoomerang. Why is that? It's because when we throw out goodwill, he's talking about throwing out something that people need right now. Goodwill, favor, uh, you know, good uh, savings, you know, uh, something that's positive. When we throw out goodwill, it's going to come back to you. Uh, that's called the law of reciprocity. When you throw out something, that means you're throwing out something in, 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 the, in the universe. What that does is it creates a, a uh, frequency or a trigger for something to come back to you. So we created this company, Mr. Buzz created this company. He says it's our company, so I'm gonna call it mine. Uh, I treat it like mine. So uh, this company called iBoomerang, guys, let's talk about the uh, disclaimer. And basically, it basically means that if you work, you get paid. If you don't work, you don't get paid. Uh, this is not a get rich opportunity, but this is a get rich quick opportunity, but it is an opportunity to get rich, okay? And so we're gonna talk about a lot of money tonight. And so we have to put this disclaimer in place because we don't want people to think that if they just get in one little position, they don't have to do anything. They don't have to do any work. This is a working opportunity for those who seek it and it will bless you accordingly, okay? So it's time for us to take control, not just of our time, but also our money, okay? And, and, and as I said, I've got time freedom right now and I'm just loving it, guys. So you know, time for you to start a, a home-based business. Why is it time to do that? Because everybody's at home right now. And if you understand the benefits of a home-based business, you get up to what, I think it was like 300 tax benefits here in the United States to have a home-based business. So think about that. You know, you, the, the mere fact that if you, you say that you've started a home-based business at your home, uh, you basically, you, you write off the square footage of that room that you have your, your, your office in. You get to write off a portion of your cell phone. You get to write off your mileage. Uh, you get to write off, God, I write off products. I write off everything uh, with my home-based business. So it's our mission is to provide an opportunity to succeed without selling by offering a five-star lifestyle at three-star prices. Let me say that again, because I heard myself say it fast. Our mission is to provide an opportunity to succeed without selling by offering a five-star lifestyle at three-star prices. So what we're gonna do is you're gonna, we're gonna take you from that old outdated era of, of business, that old 60 to 70 years of way um, uh, network marketing was done, direct sales was done, whereas you had to actually have a skill set to sell and you have also had to have a skill set to recruit. And most people that I knew did not have either. They did not want to sell, they didn't want to recruit, but they wanted to earn some money. And there's a difference. And so a lot of people become customers as well because the products are good. But think about this when you have a product based business, typically that product is marked up so high. Uh, that uh, that the uh, company has to 
uh, you know, satisfy their, their uh, bottom line. So they continue to mark up the, the, the wholesale prices of the product, which increased our retail prices. And what happened was that our product started showing up on Amazon and eBay. So, you know, going through that process, you know, was not fun. And I'm, I'm speaking basically in reference to the coffee business. So what we're going to do is we're going to take you out of that old era where customers pay more and only the most experienced went into a modern era where you make money only when customers save money. Advanced tools will help you succeed with the proven leadership with this. Okay. So what I want to share with you, this is just our leadership, uh, just some of our corporate leaders. And this is Mr. Bugs uh, in, the, in the yellow shirt. Uh, this is the CEO, the innovator the chairman of the board, the whole nine yards, the gentleman that you know, literally continues to uh, incentivize us to do more in this business. And I'll share with you about that in a second. But he started his industry over th about 30 years ago. Started uh, right out of college uh, and didn't finish college. Uh, went on a scholarship in the whole nine yards. But guys, he, he wanted to make money and he didn't want to work for anybody. And so he got to this industry. He, didn't only, he only made about $500. Uh, a month for the first seven years. And most people will say, you know, well, why did he stay in it? You know, why did he stick around? You know, for seven years, you only made $500 a month. Guys, when you have a vision and when you have a desire and you have a dream that's bigger than any, any challenge you have in your life, it doesn't matter. He saw something and he went after it. And the blessing is, the blessing is that he stayed his course because millions have been affected by the decision that he decided not to quit. I believe he failed for the first seven years and he failed forward. He's not a quitter. So in 1997, he developed a formula and a system to achieve rapid success. With that, he took that company, CyberWise, to about $30 million in the first two to three years, okay? That's great business, $30 million for a company. He built that system and showed them how to do it. And then he decided to partner with Organo. And Organo, he took that company, like I said in the beginning, uh, to, three, to $3 billion in the first 10 years of business. And like I said, over 3, 3 million customers worldwide or Salesforce, um, you know, he, 45 plus millionaires uh, in that business as well. He's been documented as the millionaire maker. Okay, he is the number one income earner in the world. Uh, $100 million from one sitting position with that company. Guys, there's nothing he has not accomplished and there's nothing he needs. So why would he go and create a business why would he start investing in something like that? Why would he buy up other businesses to help us do what we want, to help us grow businesses? Why would he do that? Because he's a giver. He didn't have to. He set. All the people on this, on this page are, are, are millionaires. They're set. So why would Mr. Bugs take time and effort? Because his purpose was not fulfilled, in my opinion. He was still working towards his purpose. And so... He, he, he introduced this company to us, Mr. Edwin uh, Haynes, the Global Master Ambassador, my sponsor, the gentle giant, uh, uh, just a, so much respect for this gentleman. He has been sought out all over the world. I mean, all over the world. I'm all the way down to Australia, to Africa, to Europe, to Jamaica, all of the United States. This gentleman is one of those people that, you know what, he, he has your ear and, and, and he'll listen to you. When you're speaking, he's listening. To, so he's very intentional about what he's doing. And so he's the global master ambassador, the first person, Mr. Bugs, helped earn a million dollars in this industry and also in this particular company. He sits at the top of this business. Then you have T. Gray, VP of operations, uh, uh, very well known in his, own, uh, in his own efforts as well, um, uh, made uh, multiple six figures in this company, in this industry, I should say. Then you have Mark Kithcart, VP of marketing out of Silicon Valley. Uh, this gym has worked with Fortune 500 companies, uh, just a brilliant mind in marketing. Then you have Lori Spears, director of travel, we call her the the travel goddess, guys. Uh, she goes before Congress for, on our behalf of the travel industry. Then you have David Manning, the CEO of, of Extreme Travel, which is the partnered company with iBoomerang to handle the travel vertical of iBoomerang. Okay, then you have Peter Hirsch, chief giving officer with his wife, Karen Hirsch, and they're over the Boom Foundation, our nonprofit. Peter's also an attorney as well as a pastor. So our team created a concept to make the future business easier. And we're doing that with this with our product that we created called the PRIB, the Perpetual Residual Income Builder. So let me give you a little bit about the PRIB. And I'm gonna slow down because I, I feel myself just running. Uh, the PRIB, and I, I think it's because I'm just so excited. Uh, we're in full momentum swing and I'm just loving it. Uh, but the PRIB is one of those, if, let, me, let me put it in perspective. You, you've heard of Alexa, you've heard of uh, Google Assist, you've heard of Siri, 
And so now let me introduce you to the PRIB. The PRIB is one of those, uh, those, those technologies that we're going to actually use for data analytics and, and artificial intelligence. It's already being used as the, as the container, basically, or the place where all of our data is stored. And so you're probably saying, Latanya, what are you talking about? I'm talking about all of the customers that we're going to acquire, all of the verticals, the businesses that we're going to, to, to purchase and to create are going into the PRIB. And so just like when you go on Amazon, and I, I went to Amazon, I was looking up some, uh, some IZOD uh, pants and shirt, uh, and, and, and I purchased them. And they're still showing up in my emails, my Facebook account, everywhere I go. I saw this, I saw that. The, the exact thing that I purchased is showing up everywhere. That's called data analytics and artificial intelligence. If you think about uh, Amazon, uh, when they first started their business, they started as a book company. And when they started as a book company, guys, they only sold books. They didn't sell, you know, every piece of digital uh, equipment, every piece of, uh, you know, clothing and shoes. They didn't sell all that then. They sold books. And when I went to go buy books on Amazon, Amazon was checking out my, my, my data. See, when I went in to look for a book, I would put in mystery or, you know, uh, or, or, you know anything that, that was, you know, like a sleuth book, you know, like, you know, whodunit type books. I love those books. And so it kept up with that information, that data. And it would market to me and says, hey, Latanya, since you purchased this book, you'll probably like that book. And it would market to me those types of books, right? And so what Amazon was doing, Amazon was paying attention and collecting my my uh, patterns of, of purchase. They were looking at my habits of purchasing and they were collecting that content, that data and putting it and storing it under Latanya's profile. And so when I went in, they would always have a book that was ready for me to, to be market, market to me. Amazon has grown. Uh, Jeff Bezos, you know, brilliant mind. Some people might not like him, but he's a brilliant mind. He took that little bitty company to well over multiple billions of dollars right now, guys. And now he is the number one retailer in the world because he's taken artificial intelligence and data analytics and put it into a system. Whereas whenever you go to it, you're going to be marketed. So wherever you go into Amazon, if you don't purchase, you're going to see it in Facebook. You're going to see it in Instagram. You're going to see it in your emails. So think about that. So what we've done is we've taken a company and we put it into the print. And that first company that we put in is called iBoomerang. It's the travel component of this company. And so the PRIB will do these things for you, okay? I'm not even gonna talk about traditional business because it doesn't do any, you know, you have to do all these things yourself for traditional business. You have to follow up, you have to sell, the direct sales, you have to do all those things except training and events. That's handled for you by the corporate staff. Then you have franchise, well, you have to pay millions of dollars just to get a franchise, just to even invest in a franchise. Uh, McDonald's, you have to have a million liquid in order to just be a part of the concept of even becoming them a part of, of McDonald's. So they'll do all those things for you, but it costs you money, a lot of money. But when you go to our PRIB, our PRIB will do everything for you. It'll follow up. It'll do the selling. It'll do the upselling. It'll do the cross-selling. It'll do the welcome orientation, training, upgrades, events, retention. That's what the PRIB will do for you. It will do all of the work for you. Your main focus in this business is just to go out and get customers. And you're going to say, well, Latanya, how am I supposed to go get customers and get them into the PRIB? I'm glad you asked. So our travel platform is a platform which saves our, cu saves our customers up to 35% when they travel. We, as TSA, save up to 70%. So our iGo Travel is the front door to the PRIB. So how do we get customers? We typically go, we ask them. When you travel, would you like to spend more or would you like to spend less? When we talk to friends, family, acquaintances, doctors, lawyers, attorneys, uh, you know, teachers, uh, retired people, uh, uh, you know, Generation X people, whenever they want to travel, when they spend money, would they like to spend more or would they like to spend less? Would they like to have a five-star uh, experience at a three-star price? That's what we asked them. And they said, well, yeah, I would love to save up to 35% of my travel. Great. I'm giving away free accounts. All I need is your contact information. I'll send you a free account. And now they're your customer for life. What happens? Johnny, Sue, and, 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 and Bubba, and, and John, and, and, and Reggie, they all go into the PRIB. Everybody that you give an account to, they go into the PRIB now. They go into this beautiful PRIB. 
okay? We've already given out, that was uh, back in 2019 where we uh, actually gave out 500,000 customers. Uh, we, we actually acquired 500,000 customers. Now we have close to a million customers. Guys, we're kicking. We have not slowed down. We've had our best, we've had our best business during the pandemic, pan pandemic. Go figure, okay? So travel is an $8 trillion industry. This is why it's, you know, I believe, you know, we got into travel. Uh, because, first of all, it's easy to get into travel. Travel is sexy. First of all, people love to travel. I, I met with a gentleman today. He was a retired gentleman. He's a widow. And he says he's just so tired of being at home. He says the whole point of retiring was to be able to go and travel the world. And he can't do that right now. But I said in due season, in, in due season, it'll come. But understand, travel is, con is controlled by two holding companies, two businesses, Booking Holdings and Expedia Group. They are not controlled by Booking.com, Travelocity, Expedia, uh, Orbitz. No, all of those aggregated websites are up under Booking Holdings or Expedia Group, and they, they control 45 websites up to $190 billion in 2018. As you can see, travel is a huge industry, $8 trillion. This is the breakdown over here, Asia, $6 billion. You got all the way down to Africa for almost half a billion per day in sales. Guys, so they offer the same retail prices and markup because these are re really retail prices. There are some discount here, but they're not true discount. We have behind the curtain prices. So we offer the same inventory and we pass the savings on to you. So let me just give you an example uh, quickly as we go through this. The Fort, New York City Four and a Half Star Hotel on Expedia is $339 per night. On our iGo platform is $178 nightly, a savings of $161. Guys, this is in, in Paris, France, uh, $440 per night. On our platform, $130 a night, $310 savings. Can you imagine that you're not just going to go over there for one night and how much money that, that you can earn? I'll show you how you can earn money by giving people these, these accounts. And then you have New York Rental Company, where is that, that rental, pro, uh, that rental uh, 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 price was $392 for that, for that package. And on our package, uh, on iGo, is $221, a savings of $171. These are actual receipts here at the bottom. Uh, I'm going to go straight to Mr. Bugs, whereas his uh, was in Cabo St. Lucas at a five-star all-inclusive resort hotel. And uh, it was during his, his birthday, if I'm not mistaken. And it's $1,348.94 was the cost of the reservation. He saved $1,589, and he got credits of 1,687 credits. Those credits will go towards another trip, guys, okay? And so that's some of the receipts, but we also have access to core services. So this is that five-star lifestyle, three-star prices. We have the hotels, rental cars, and cruises, but we also have flights where there's no discounts on flights, but there are some on international flights, to my understanding. But we put flights as a part of our platform so that you can book them as a convenience and you'll also earn points or credits when you book your flights with iBoomerang, okay? And then you have the homes, which are multi-million dollar homes, uh, just like um, on Airbnb, but these are those homes that you actually pay uh, specifically through like Hilton Vacations and all those vacation companies that wanna sell you these, these, these wonderful packages for like 25 to $30,000, guys, there's nothing, we, we, have, we don't even come close to that. And you have access to a full array of homes all over the world through our platform. Then you have weeks vacation, whereas you can actually get a week of a week stay in Vegas or in Florida or any place, in, in, even in Mexico, guys, for like $199 starting at that price for an entire week at a hotel. And then you have marketplace where you can actually book, I mean, you can actually bid on vacation. Then you have timeshare where if you own a timeshare, you can actually place your timeshare on our platform and then we'll have access to go out and utilize that timeshare. But not, not only that, we offer wine club, theme parks, shopping rewards, worldwide tours. We play golf. We have all those things are discounted as well as you earn credits when you actually book them with iBoomerang. So do you boomerang? Yes, we do. So remember I was telling you, I'm gonna show you how you can actually get those accounts out to your friends and family. So with our business, we generate a code, what we call our back office. We generate a code online. We send the code via text or email to that, that friend of family. And what they will do, they will go to igoboom.com uh, after they receive the code and they will activate that code through igoboom.com. Every time a code is activated or account is created, we feed children that are undernourished proper nutrition all over the world. 
Guys, just in 2019, we've already uh, fed 4.4 million servings of proper nutrition, okay? So that's how you get the, the uh, technology out to the world. We give technology away for free so that when people purchase their travel, we get paid 50% of what they save. So I'm gonna share that with you here in a second. But this is how the Travel Savings Bonus example works. So if I'm a TSA ambassador, you know, most of the people that are on the call or our partners on the call, they're ambassadors. Some of them came in uh, at first class or, or other packages, but at this position, 41% uh, savings, we're down in Cancun at a five-star resort hotel, and the public price for that stay is 1046 the savings is $424 for me. The total for my package for my trip was $621. That's $174 a night. But guess what? I'm not going by myself. I'm inviting some friends to go with me. So I give them a boomerang. So this is me. I give my friends a boomerang. When they book their trip, same hotel, same stay, same room, same floor, same night, the, the whole nine yards, nothing's different. Their package is $834, they save $212. I think they'll be okay with saving $212 instead of spending $1,046, they're only spending $834. But when I take a boomerang and I give it to my friends, they book their trip, they take their trip, what happens is they save money and coming back to me is a travel savings bonus of $106. So you're gonna say, well, what did you do to get $106? I gave away technology for free. I gave away what Uber does all the time. They give away their apps to so people put them on their phones. Uh, Lyft put them on their phones. Airbnb has an app. You go through there and, and all, all they did was create a system of access. Uber created a system of access, Airbnb, Lyft, and all they do is when people utilize their apps, they get paid, right? In other words, if I drove for Uber, and, and, and somebody you know, hired me to come pick them up, I get paid using my own car. Uber doesn't own any cars or any taxes, but yet they're the number one transportation company in the world. The number one transportation company in the world. If, if, you, call, if, you, if you call 100 people ask them right now if they had an Uber uh, app on their phone, you would probably get about 95% of people said yes. Guys, we're ground floor. We're brand new. We're, we're, the plane is on the ground. The plate is on the ramp, in fact, okay, ready for takeoff. We're, we're right here. And what we're doing is all we're doing is giving away this technology for free, this technology for free. So whenever my customers take a trip, I get paid 50% as a, a referring ambassador as a travel savings bonus. This is unique and only propri proprietary to Ibomarine. Nobody has this business. No one has this technology like we do. Okay, so one of the fastest growing segments of travel is the drive share industry. So if you understand when people get to the airport, they're needing a ride. And the one thing they do is they go up and they pick up their phone and they'll set up an a, a appointment for Uber to come pick them up or Lyft to come pick them up. But what if there was another company in town called Vibe Ride? Remember, I told you the Prib is going to house multiple verticals, multiple companies. The first company we put into the PRIV is the travel platform because we're gonna acquire our customers that way. Then the second company we put into the PRIV is the Vibe Ride, our brand new drive share company. It's not, your, it's not your usual drive share company. I'm gonna share with you why. But guess what? What if there's another company coming into the PRIV? Maybe there's a company called Boom Mobile, which is a brand new mobile phone service. And what if your customers transition from where they are to your mobile phone service, and every time they pay their bill for the month, you get paid a commission? That's just another company. What if there's another company coming, and all your customers are sitting here in the crib? How do I get my customers? I go through the drive, I go through the, the travel industry, and I get my customers, okay? So what sets us apart? What makes Vibe Ride so different than, and, and there's no competition, trust me, None at all, excuse me. There's no competition, but you know, we sit, I, sit, I, say, I tell my drivers, I said, we're just a little bit different. We're just a little bit different. So what we do is we go out and our app will do this for us. We, when we get our customers for, for the ride share, what we do is when they get our app, they can create their own vibe. They create their own vibe, right? 
And what that does is they can choose to whether they want to have a conversation with Armando, who's the driver, okay? They can choose whether they want to have the, the car set to 72 or 74 in temperature. They can choose whether they want to listen to rock and roll or R&B. They can also choose that if I'm out late at night with my girls, speaking to the ladies, and they don't want to be picked up by a gentleman, they hit girl power and a female picks them up. That's just some of the technology of the Vibrite app, okay? That's just some of it. I want you to think about that. So that sets us apart, sets us apart first of all, okay? But this is what really sets us apart. How many of you think about it? How many of you know Uber drivers right now and Lyft drivers? Typically, they're driving for each other. If you look at an Uber, he'll have the Uber sign and he'll have the Lyft uh, little light in his car all at the same time. Cool, multiple streams of income. I totally agree. There are people who are earning thousands of dollars doing this. They're driving. But guys, think about it. You know, everybody doesn't want to drive, but we give a opportunity or an option to either drive or you can build a fleet of drivers for you and your family. And you can also get your own customer base. So you're saying, Latanya, what are you talking about? You know, the ride share industry has been around for a little while now. It's been around for a little while now. And there's so much money in the ride share industry. But think about it. That's only uh, earning money on your own efforts when you're just driving. The drivers typically don't make money until they turn on the app and they turn off the app. That's when they make their money. But ask a Uber, Uber driver or a Lyft driver, what happens when they go to bed at night? Do you earn money when you go to sleep? That's the question you want to ask them. Can you earn money when you're sleeping at night? And their answer is going to be, well, no, there's no way. Well, can I introduce you to a way that you can earn money when you sleep? And they're going to probably say, please do. And I, and I would say, look, I'm not telling you to, you know, let go of Uber. I'm not telling you to let go of Lyft. I'm just want to give you a new idea, a new way of thinking about business so that you can earn money not only when you drive, but when others drive that you've actually given them an app to, and when customers ride, you earn as well when they ride. They don't have to ride with you. They can ride with any driver. As long as, you, as, long as they got their app or their account from you, you're going to get paid a, uh, a commission as well. I hope you guys understand that. So when the drivers drive, you'll earn commission. And when your customers ride, you'll earn a commission. They don't have to ride with the driver that you signed up. They can ride with any driver. As long as they're riding with a vibe ride driver, guess what? And you gave them an app, you get paid. Guys, we're in Florida. We're in Orlando, Miami, St. Uh, 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 Fort Lauderdale, and Tampa. Four cities in Florida. We're, we're, that's, our, that's our beta testing market. Uh, Dallas, Fort Worth area, Houston. We're in the beta testing. I just found out we're about to go international. We're going to go to, uh, to Mexico. That's one of the next places we're gonna open, but there are gonna be more states and cities here in the United States that we're gonna open. But I want you to understand this. You're not limited to Houston. If you know drivers in Pensacola, if you know drivers in Michigan or Iowa or Wisconsin, or if you know people there, you want to let them know what's coming. If you know people in Chicago, guess what? You can build a fleet of drivers in any city, state, or country that we're doing business in, okay? So that's the ride share. You can earn up to 75% on your rides. It's, it's the, for the first 50 rides, it's, it's 70%, and then 75% on, on all 50 after that, on, on, on all the rides after the first 50. Okay, so this is the passive model for the drivers. Guess what? You go out and you get 10 drivers. You give out 10 apps to your drivers. Remember, when you sign them up, when you give them that free account, what happens is they go into the PRIB, your hands are off of them. The PRIB does all the work. The PRIB uh, uh, follows up with your drivers, gets them registered, takes them through the process of getting done so that they can go out and start driving. So once you do that, all you do is give them the account and the PRIB does everything else for you. Remember, it does the follow-up, it does the upselling and all those things for you. So you, all you have to do is get the information to the people, give them the account and get them into your system. They're your, your, your drivers for life. So whenever they drive, you know, they'll, they will uh, actually, you know, be under you. So understand this. You get 10 drivers. 
and let's say they earn fifty thousand a year. That means it's a five hundred thousand. That's a half a million dollars that's earned that year, or that's generated in business that year, because you gave them a free app. You just earned fifteen thousand dollars. You didn't have to train anybody. You didn't have to rent any cars. You didn't have to create no insurance. You didn't have to do any of those things. All you did was give them free technology. They signed up. You get paid. Here's our rider passive model. You go out and get 10 riders, and for every five, there's a free ride. So, every, so what they're going to do is they're going to refer that same process. So if I go out and get my five, then I get a free ride. So my 10 went out and got their five. Now they got 50 riders. Now my 50 riders did the same thing. They went out and got their five, and now they got their free ride. So they gave away five uh, you know, referrals, and now there's 250 riders. So if you add all this up, you got 310 riders right here. 250, 50, and 10, 310. And on average, each rider spends $50 per month. That's $15,500 that's generated. And 3% of that is $465 a month. That's almost $6,000 a year. Tell me what job that you can go out and increase your bottom line, your income to six by $6,000 without your, your manager or what they used to call your boss going off. <laughs> There's no job out there for that. So no more ways to get paid? Absolutely. So the customer acquisition model. So this is where we're talking about your customers going and, and actually traveling. So if you go out and give 10 accounts away, 10 boomerangs, you have 10 friends in your phone. You say, okay, that person travels, that person travels, that person travels. And you give them all this free technology. And they take one trip a year, just one. They're not let they're, that's, that's not their maximum, but that's a minimum. So if they only take one trip a year and they, uh, and they save $600 per trip, that's a $6,000 annual savings that was just generated. Because you gave away that free technology, remember I said gave away, your, your travel savings bonus that you just put in your pocket is $3,000. That you just put in your, your pocket, okay, is $3,000. That's proprietary to iBoomerang. Nobody else has this technology. Nobody else has this ability to do this. Okay. So team builder model, this is where now you can leverage. Remember I said, we are a customer acquisition company and everything I showed you for the last, I would say 40 minutes was about getting customers. And now I'm talking to you about building a team. If you're interested in leveraging, if you want to, if you have people that you know, that are a business minded who want to create a, a, a legacy income or if they want to create businesses and have that tax break and, every, and everything that comes with it, this part is for you. Guys, in the dual team structure, iBoomerang allows you to build two teams. You have a left team and a right team. I'm not going to go through the numbers, but I want you to understand these two positions are very important. The, the first person up under you is called positions of equity because everybody that you sponsor after these two people have to fall below them, okay? Mr. Barnes had about a gazillion people on our call last night. He had so many guests on the call. Anybody that got started, they should have been fighting for these two positions right here, and I believe they're already taken. These two positions right here are already taken. That means that everybody that came on that call last night that gets started, guess what? They're all going to fall below those two positions. But think about it. You're going to benefit from everything that this person does, this person does, this person does. You're going to benefit from that. Anything that is done on the inside as well. Because you took the first two positions, guys. Okay? And that, that, that dual team pays out a quarter of a million dollars per week. Okay? Up to 20% of the dual team in your first 30 days. So how do you get started? $49.95 gets you at standby. You know, uh, everything is done in the aerospace jargon. So you're in, at standby at the airport. You're sitting there. You're twiddling your thumbs. You're tapping your toe. You're like, can I get on the plane? Can I, can I get on the plane? <laughs> Am I going to get on the plane? Is somebody going to not get on the plane so I can get on the plane? And so that's a wholesale starter kit for us. That's one boomerang customer site, five boomerangs to give away those five free accounts, that technology. You get a chance to earn 25% of the savings bonus, of the travel savings bonus, only 25%. Uh, you also get 25% of referral commissions. Okay. That's, that's if you uh, have a, a, a huge party like a, a, a destination wedding. You can send that information to uh, the concierge department at Extreme Travel, and they would do all the booking for you and pay you 25%. You didn't, you didn't do anything but send them the information. 
Also, you get an eye-to-side interactive presentation, which does this presentation for you. Not in such detail as a human being, but it is technology that would do it for you, okay? And then you have the online business management system. All this is $49.95 one time, plus a $49.95 monthly subscription. If you stay in standby, I do not recommend anybody staying in standby. Why? Because it's just a glorified customer position, in my opinion. And you're just a customer that has a little means of earning some income. But, you, you know, remember I said you're sitting at the airport waiting to see if you can get on the airplane. Well, you can get on the airplane here. You can get either coach class, a business class, or first class. Coach class gives you the IGO booking engine. And that's the engine that shows you all the prices of all the trips and the vacation that you can take or business trips that you, you can take. It also gives you access to hotels, flights, and, and rental cars, okay? You get 10 boomerangs, okay, 10 accounts that you give away. You also earn 50% now of the travel savings bonus. You earn to do a 10% in that dual team structure and you get the prib and the vibe rides. That's all for one, one investment of $250 one time. $250 one-time investment plus the $49.95 because everybody gets started at that position, but that's $250 one time. The business club class gives you everything in coach plus cruises. <coughs> Excuse me. Plus cruises, right? Now you have 25 boomerangs. You also earn 100% of the dual team uh, uh, bonus. I'm sorry, of the travel savings bonus, okay? And then you get a chance to earn up to 12% of the dual team structure and you get access to the pre-op and vibe rides. This business class is a one-time investment of $500, okay? Plus the $49.95. But then at first class, you get access to everything. That gives you everything in business class plus homes and weeks. And remember what I was telling you about those homes that when, if you, if you go with, with, uh, with uh, let's say Hilton Vacations or there's some other companies out there that have been selling vacation clubs for years for you know, 15, 20, $30,000, you're going to get what, what they have. You're going to get that uh, inventory with us as well as you're going to have marketplace lifestyle, weeks, vacation, timeshares. You're going to have 50 boomerangs, 100% of the travel savings bonus. Okay. Dual team up to 20% for your th first 30 days. You're going to get pre-up and vibe rights for a one-time investment of $1,000 plus $49.95. All through these packages, guys, this is where the business starts. In order to do business with iBoomerang, in order to go out and earn income, it only costs you on a monthly basis to earn to, to pay $99.95 as a monthly subscription. That's all it would cost you to do business with this company. Guys, let me share something with you. iBoomerang is in over 188 countries. What business can you partner with? What franchise, if there was any, that you could invest a thousand forty-nine in and only pay $99.95 to cover your your cost of business, that means maintaining all of your websites and, and, and your, in your PRIB and your trainings and things of that nature for one payment of $100 a month US, and you're doing business now in 188 countries. If you know people in Germany, if you know people in Australia, if you know people in Africa, if you know people in Europe, if you know people in Mexico, you can do business there because we are there. And all you have to do is uh, purchase a pack, invest in one of these packs, and your monthly subscription to do business there is only a hundred dollars a month. I don't know any other business you can do that in, not at all. So I want to share with you guys to uh, definitely get back with the person who invited you to this call. Uh, you know, I have thoroughly enjoyed sharing the information tonight with you guys. Um, I want to go ahead and uh, let you guys know. Get started now. Uh, join the team. There's so much information we can share. Everything is done digitally. All of our trainings are digitally. Tomorrow morning, we'll be uh, in flight school at eight o'clock in the morning via Zoom and Facebook Live. I invite those guests who are on the call, come see what our training platform looks like. Come see what it is that you're going to attain. You know, this is, you know, that 99.95, these guys do it for free, but that 99.95, this is what covers those things. This is, that's what covers, that, that subscription covers that type of information. Not only that, we have a TSA orientation. We have all kinds of trainings, uh, but we have, you have multiple uh, uh, engines, multiple uh, uh, websites with this business as well. So you're not just getting one website when you get when you get started with us. You're going to get an iGo platform. You're going to get your you know the, everything for your your I decide all those things that are going to come with your business. So the disclaimer is still the same. If you work, you get paid. If you don't work, you get, you don't get paid. It's just as simple as that. 
like Mr. Biss always says, you can show up at the gym, you can pay your fee, and and, you, and and if you don't if you don't push the if you don't push the dumbbells, if you don't get on the bicycle, the weight is not going to come off. But you're still paying that monthly subscription. Why not get the best of the of the of the results that you want when you're actually making the investment? And that's what we want you guys to understand. This is an opportunity to invest in a company that's ground floor. We are on the ground. The plane is right here. But we are going, we're in formulation and we're on our way to concentration. We're not playing. This company is already headed towards $100 million and we're not even a, legally a year old. Our anniversary is in September. Towards 100, I've been with this gentleman when we hit $100 million in the last company. Guys, he is a forecaster. He understands what success looks like. He understands how to build businesses. He builds the comp plan. Success is not by happenstance. It is a, it is a structured, uh, planned event. He structures, he plans it. He, ha he plans his calendars, not just months, not just years, but decades in advance. He has this business already mapped out for the next five to 10 years. You want to partner with people who think outside the box. I'm just being real. I don't want to partner with people that were like me five, six, seven, eight, ten 10 years ago. I wouldn't partner with people like me back then. And I'm not saying partner, I'm saying partner with that boomerang. But you want to partner with people who are going to think outside the box, who are going to take your best interest at heart and level the playing field so everyone can win. Remember, observe the masses and do the opposite. The opposite of direct sales was, is now, is this business. In other words, we're not selling, we're giving away. We, we, we're taking away that, that sting of selling and recruiting. You don't have to do that part if you don't want to, but you can still create a six-figure income just by sharing the technology. We have a young lady in our, in our business right now. She has over 10,000 customers. She's just been giving out customers, giving out the technology left and right. I have a business partner right now. She just went over 1,000, pers a person I personally sponsored. She has over 1,000 customers right now. Guess what? When her customers buy, guess what? I get a piece of that. When their customers buy, you get a piece of that. That's what this business is about, guys. So with that being said, it's getting late. I don't want to hold anybody too long, but I just wanted to just make sure you get back with the person that invited you. And if there are any questions right now, I'm open to answering any questions from the guests. Uh, if you have any, please unmute yourself and uh, please pose your question. I'd be glad to answer it. And then we have crickets. <laughs> So I guess we good, huh? Why is it the guests never ask the questions? And then they get off the phone, and they call the people, and they say, "Now tell me more about this business." Don't they do that? You know, we we now tell me a little bit more. And, and, and I'm telling right, Miss Bell. They, 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 are, are, what what now? What is what did she just say? What I can do? What you know? They go ask the question after they get off the phone. I don't bite. I'm hungry, but I don't bite. <laughs> Okay, Ms. Carter is all on you. Thank you, guys. Love you. Thank you. Uh, we're almost done. Ms. Carter, you got it? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't. I, I heard my name, but I thought you were teasing me. No, no, Ms. no, no. It's all oh, on you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, Ms. Johnson, you absolutely rocked that call. You talked fast, but I wrote fast. I mean, I was taking some serious notes today. Some things I had forgotten, you brought back to my remembrance. And so I know that the guest got an ear full tonight. And she teased y'all, but I, we know it's true that you guys are going to say, now what? And that's so true. So, But it's all great. As long as you get your questions answered and you get started and you go for your dreams, everything is fine. So uh, I don't know what else to say. You said it all tonight. It's no convincing. We don't do that. We share the information. You guys make an educated decision, and you have been educated tonight. So all the thing that's missing is trust. So we like to say, just give us 1% of your trust, and we'll earn that other 99%. That's hands down the truth. So in all your questions and doubts and you know, confusion and don't know what is your gut saying? Does your gut say, I can, I think I can do that? Does your gut say, um, 
Well, they said they were going to help me. I think they will. Let me ask the person who called me. They're going to say, yes, I'm going to help you. And we have a system that's going to help you. So I don't want to sell it to you, but I'm just reiterating how well thought out this company is. And for once in our lives, we get a chance to participate in something that is created, especially for us. And here I don't even have my, my camera on. Especially for us, by us, to us, and we get to make a decision to win if we so desire. So, Ms. Johnson, again, thank you for being an incredible leader. Uh, Mr. Benson for taking care of the tech, all the team members who support and who have guests. Yes, we love you already. Uh, Ms. Johnson always says, there's nothing you can do about that because that's who we are. So thanks guys for letting me share. And, you know, I'm always pumped up. So there you go. Mr. Benson, you have anything you want to share? Any team members? No, I just want to say tonight was a great tech night. Yeah. And so, Ms. Johnson, excellent presentation. Ms. Carter, thank you for sharing. Guest, welcome, welcome. This is going to be in your head for the rest of your life. Before we it hang sure up, will. before we hang up, I want to uh, invite uh, Mr. Barnes uh, just to share a little bit. Um, okay. he, he had an incredible night last night and uh, he's still on fire and I told him to stay lit yes. as I shared with the whole team stay lit yes. uh, and you, you always want to stay lit and I, all we want to do is just pour a little gas on you just keep going so Mr. Barnes if you don't mind uh, you know why why I boomerang and um, you know what what's got you so fired up because it's, it's, it's very evident that you're fired up for me for me, Ms. Johnson, and it was a great, great, great presentation. Thank you so much. And absolutely. Mr. Benson, you're right. It was a, absolutely a great tech night, <laughs> you know. But um, for me, um, the, you know, I, I, I come from an IT background and um, have done I, IT for years. And when you're talking about the data analytics and, you know, you're talking about the artificial intelligence, it just makes sense to me, seeing what Amazon has done, that this company is going to explode, you know, with that technology. So when y'all, when you talked about it the night that I joined, um, it just made sense to me that, man, this thing is going to really grow. All you have to do is follow the process and the training that we get is incredible. So, you know, I'm just excited about it. So. Excellent, excellent. That's it. Thank you, Ms. Johnson. Absolutely. Thank you, Mr. Barnes. You, appreciate Carter. you. Yes, absolutely. Appreciate you. Absolutely. So I just wanted to uh, allow him to speak because, you know, he's been on fire and, and I just love it. And, you know, I always want to recognize anybody that's just going out there getting it done. Uh, not This whole team is getting it done. And, and, and I'm just... I'm, I'm just so happy for everyone. Like I said, I'm, I'm so excited. You know, that's why I think I speak so fast. Uh, but just so super excited for the entire team. And, uh, you know, so we appreciate everyone, guys. This is the time to make sure that we stay in the trenches. We're going for that 90-day blitz. I think we're probably around day 50 now. Uh, so we're not done. We might be halfway or over the hump. But we're not going downhill. No, we're steadily going up the hill. And uh, when, Mr. when we get Mr. Haynes in the house, it's going to be, uh, that's just going to be the fireworks on top of it. So uh, like we said, the goal is to make sure that we get everybody to, to director uh, in this business. And that, you know, and that's the goal still as we go through the end of the month into the new month of August. Uh, so I don't want you guys to forget that. And uh, guests, we do have a major event taking place in early September uh, 4th, and, 4th to the 6th. It's all virtual. And uh, the person that invites you to the call can actually share the information with you about that as well. I just want to put that on your agenda. And, um, you know, guys, I'm done for the night. And I appreciate you guys. Anybody else? Because we can go ahead and shut it down. All I right. want to say I just put in the messages before everybody chimes out mm -hmm. the uh, Zoom information for tomorrow morning's oh. uh, training that mm -hmm. she spoke about that our leaders, they're going to announce something special tomorrow. So if you're thinking about it and you want to know the culture of the company, yes. then I would make sure that I'm on that call tomorrow to further answer any questions that you may have. Starts at 8 p.m. I put 8, the information 8 in there. 8 a.m., excuse me. It starts at 8 a.m. Central Standard Time. 
And so the Zoom information is in the chat. You can copy that, you can write it down, you can screenshot it, and uh, you will enjoy it. It's going to be a blast. Absolutely. It's going to be a blast. So a I'm going to stop there. I just wanted to make sure I'll let everybody know I put that in there. Thank you, Ms. Johnson. Oh, my pleasure. Thank you, Mr. Benson, for all that you do. Sister Hardy, everybody, look, guys, I love you. I'm going to tell you again, ain't nothing I can do about it. <laughs> Let's go get this thing done. Let's go get those directors. Let's get it done, guys. We're kicking right now. Let's love get you done. too, man. I'm love y'all. All right. Hey, Jason. All right. Hey. Bye, y'all. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Miss Bell. <laughs>